We are so excited to welcome Jean-Marc Genereau here to the show, a major dance competition set to take place in October. But before the main event, there's a fundraiser being held in the city this weekend, the man behind the plan. <laughs> Oh Ta-da! Jazz hands. Uh, Jean-Marc, it is great to meet you. Yes. And I know you've been traveling so much, so thank you for stopping in. That's great. It's a pleasure to be back in my own country. Uh, yes. And have my own Tim Horton. It's great. Uh, <laughs> and now you're not even sure if you've slept or not up to this point. I don't know. It's, uh, it's a little fuzzy. Yeah, it's a little weird, but I love it. I love it. Yes. A man who is full of energy that, that we know and love. So tell us what's taking place in Calgary and what brings you to town. Well, uh, this weekend we have a fundraiser, and uh, by the way, I'm not alone in this thing. Is uh, is Kelly, Eric, uh, Martin, and Diana, and my wife. The six of us uh, built this competition uh, five years ago, mm -hmm. and every um, September we have a fundraiser to uh, lead to this big, big, big event here in Calgary. Yes, and the big event come October attract some of the best dancers in the sport. Absolutely. They, uh, we bring athletes from all over the world because we have to understand that ballroom dancing, it's the name, but the activity or the sport's called dance sport, mm. and it's all over the world. So we have a mission is to bring the best athletes in the world here in Calgary to compete because when you think dance competition, it almost stopped in Toronto. And we are the biggest competition uh, west of Toronto, yeah. and we want to to uh, for the people to up. come and vi mm -hmm. visit here, this great, great, great uh, city. Okay, uh, kick up your heels in October and the fundraiser this upcoming weekend. Now, for you yourself, a lot of people recognize you, of course, from the reality show. So you think you can dance? Has the sport changed from when you first started and pre-reality TV that put a spotlight on dance? You know what? The thing that changed the most is the vocabulary. Before people didn't know what the jive was or a quick step, a cha cha, it was from the past. And now, because of those shows, they really give a new texture to it. But the world of ballroom dancing, it's a massive world and it's there since a uh, hundred years now. And uh, the, the athletes uh, become like Olympians. Mm. They, they work out, they do their thing, and uh, they dedicate their life to the sport. Mm. And that's what we're doing here. We, we invite people to come at the Hyatt uh, to come and, and see this. We have three days of fabulous events. And it's like, uh, so you think you can dance, or Dancing with the Stars, right. by the way. Um, it, it's, it's an opportunity to people to see and uh, to see it and, and move even more forward with it. Yeah, to see it firsthand, to see it live, and you call them athletes for a good reason and that they truly are that. Have you seen an interest being peaked in ballroom dancing since uh, the television interest? Yes, yeah. absolutely. Because so you think you can dance uh, in a way, um, take couples like people from uh, the hip hop world and the ballet world and they put it together and they dance a cha cha. And it's fabulous. So people say, hey, we can do that mm -hmm. and it, it give it a new taste a, a new dynamic to it and I, I think it helps a lot the, the dance schools and the general public and because on uh, on our weekend on Rocky Mountain we want the public to come and, and visit us you don't need to be a dancer we're not gonna ask you to go on a dance floor to dance they can only come and just see it uh, we have parties afterwards we have great thing masquerade ball latin party salsa Ooh, Ooh, all right it's gonna be crazy, <laughs> yes, gonna be crazy. We, we wanted you to throw down some moves and actually we have some footage of you dancing with your wife do oh, you still no, no. kick up your heel here it is right here uh, when ted and andy were watching Ooh. this footage they were worried that they were going to injure themselves just in viewing <laughs> it uh can you still spin around the dance floor yeah once in a while i have to do it it's like uh I feel a, uh, a policeman, you know, protect and serve the ballroom <laughs> dancing world. Yes. Oh my gosh. I love that woman. Sorry. That's my I wife. I love it. Right? Yeah. It's mesmerizing. Yeah, yeah. Uh, the two of you are just spectacular together. The fundraising event takes place this Saturday. The actual competition taking place on October the 23rd, as you mentioned. And through the weekend, the galas, the parties, yes. uh, the Danish Canadian Club is the place to be. Doors open at 8.30 p.m. But you've brought along some tickets yes. for, for October. Yes, oh, yes. Da -da -da. We have no one, two. <laughs> it's for Saturday the 24th because um, that's our uh, main show. And in the show, we're going to have uh, Alberta Ballet. We have So You Think You Can Dance Kids. We have uh, uh, Burlesque. We have the champion from the weekend. We all, they're all going to perform in a massive show and afterwards we have the masquerade ball and we party all night and the next day which is fabulous on Sunday we have a, um, uh, a congress where we the judges 
who judge in the comp are there to give a piece of their wisdom, and you can ask questions to the judges. Amazing. So it's fabulous. A fabulous event, and it takes place uh, end of October. These are tickets between October the 23rd and 25th to winter uh, to enter, <laughs> to win and enter. I just amalgamated words right there. I was so excited. BreakfastTelevision.ca. Uh, click on Daily Prizing. Please do tell us that you're entering for the prize, the Rocky Mountain Dance Sport, Dance Sport Grand Prix. Yes. And we'll get the hot tickets in your hand. Pleasure to meet you. Thank you so much for joining us. So we're going to do a Jean-Marc and Jill instead of a Jack and Jill together? Yeah, let's do it. Woo! Should we spin into the break? Maybe yes. during commercial. Yes. Stay and with us. If you want more information, go on uh, dancebookgrandprix.com. Okay, we'll put links up on our website, breakfasttelevision.ca. <laughs> we're going to take a quick break. I'm sweating. We'll be right back. Woo! <laughs>